So, apparently there's going to be a sequel to Star Wars Rebels, which stars Ahsoka. Um, hello everybody, welcome back to my channel, and today I'm bringing to you guys some news. Um, well, uh, maybe not necessarily some news, but uh, I, I think I already... Um, I think I already uh, did a video where I talked about some leaks that came out that apparently talked about some of the things that Lucasfilm are... Um, are planning in the uh, in the future and I think one of them was about a sequel to Rebels well anyway uh, let's let's get into this so this is uh, obviously coming to us from bounding into comics now if, if you don't know for anyone who doesn't know Star Wars Rebels is basically um, a series that talks about the, uh, the, uh, the the beginning of the Rebel Alliance like it's sort of supposed to show you the origin of like how the other rebel line started and that's the basically the the plot uh, summary of um of star wars rebels i'm not gonna get into some of the other details of the show just in case there's uh, someone who hasn't watched it yet which i i recommend you do i mean i i don't think it's as, it's as good as the uh, the clone wars but it's i I, th I think it's worth watching it's definitely better than any of the uh any of the the disney trilogy and it's just it, it is it does feel like Star Wars at least a little bit. Okay, so and apparently they're planning a, a sequel trilogy that focuses mostly on these two. Now, if you don't know who these two are, now this one you, you'll recognize definitely. This is Ahsoka from the uh, the who was first introduced in the uh, the Clone Wars television series. So I'm sure you recognize her. But in case you don't know who this is, this is Sabine Wren. She was a main character in Star Wars Rebels, and apparently she is going to be. Uh, the, the series is going to focus on these two now. But before I continue, what the um, what the, the the show might be does include a big spoiler for Rebels. So if you haven't seen, I highly recommend you click off now and maybe come back a, a, or maybe come back after you've actually seen the series and or um, but yeah, yeah, basically um, just just come back after you've seen the series or uh, uh, no, it doesn't even have to be this video just come back and uh, look into what's going on after you've seen the series because it does talk about a pretty big spoiler for the ending of the show so with that said let's continue a new rumor detailing that uh, Disney looks from developing a Star Wars Rebel sequel said to release sometime this year the rumor comes from YouTube channel YouTube channel Kessel Run Transmission a uh, host no outline at his um, uh, co-host Corey explain uh, what we've heard is that the Star Wars Rebel sequels show is in development it's going to be animated it's set for 2020 this year Corey details that the show will star Ahsoka Tano and Sabine Wren he also speculates that Star Wars The Clone Wars and Star Wars Rebel director Dave Filoni will also be attached to this new sequel series as they've gotten word he's attached to an upcoming Star Wars animated series now I just want to stop here for a second when it comes to what, what what was said right here, Dave Filoni will uh, will also be attached to this new series because they got word that apparently he's going to be attached to an upcoming Star Wars animated series. Now, the reason why this is interesting is because I also did a video um, earlier um, earlier this month where I talked about a leak that came out on uh, uh, Reddit that apparently says that Dave Filoni is going to be heading a series like another animated series that folk, that's called New Jedi Order. Now, I'm not going to talk about the, the specifics of uh, that series because I already talked about it in detail um, uh, in, in that video that I posted. I'll leave a link to that uh, at the end of this video if you want to go check it out. Um, so I'm wondering, like the, the, the reason why this is interesting is because I wonder if what they heard about Dave Filoni being attached to an upcoming Star Wars animated series, I wonder if, like, uh, like, are, are they, are, uh, like, are they, um, do they both happen to have the same source? Like the person who posted that, the person who posted that on Reddit, and the, 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 this person who um, who heard about Dave Filoni being attached to an upcoming animated se uh, series for Star Wars. It's just, it's, it's, it's interesting. Like, I'm wondering which of these could be. Uh, could be the truth is it the uh, the sequel to rebels or is it the the new jedi order series which i uh, but anyway uh, let's continue 
Uh, Star Wars Rebels ended on a cliffhanger as Ahsoka Tana returned to Lothal to recruit Sabine Wren to hunt the galaxy to find their lost comrade Ezra Bridger. Tana would make a brief cameo in Star Wars The Rise of Skywalker when her voice is heard encouraging Ray to fight back. Yeah, 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 we, we already know that. Given Tana's voice for him, he died before the events of the film. Ugh. However, Filoni took to Twitter to reassure fans that Tano's story was far from over and that she might not actually be dead. On Christmas Day, Filoni wrote on Twitter, was thinking, of you, was thinking of all of you this fine morning. Happy Holidays, Dave. He included a drawing from Gandalf from The Lord of Rings talking to Ahsoka. And Gandalf tells the former Jedi, I, okay, here it is. You can see Gandalf, there's Ahsoka. And it says, your people thought I was there too. Look how that turned out. So I guess this is... Sort of, because, uh, yeah, I mean, for anyone who's already seen the film, sorry, I guess this is a bit of a spoiler for The Rise of Skywalker, um, but basically by the end, Rey hears voices from all of the Jedi who are supposedly Force ghosts, and one of the voices you end up hearing is Ahsoka, so that led people to believe, well, oh, that means she must have died, so she's a Force ghost, which honestly pissed a lot of people off because they basically killed off a fan favorite character off screen. They killed her off off screen. They didn't even bother giving her a proper death, like yeah, all of the other characters that we like. But no, no, no. They kill her off off screen. Beautiful. Well done, Disney. Well done. So yeah, uh, apparently the um, the focus on the series. So for anyone who doesn't know, when it says, um, oh god, where is it? Uh, is it? Where is it? Oh, here it is. Uh, Star Wars Rebels ended on a cliffhanger as Ahsoka uh, find, find their lost comrade as Ezra Bur Burgess. So, like I said, this is going to continue, or con excuse me, contain a spoiler for the ending of Star Wars Rebels. But basically what ends up happening is they were fighting uh, a certain character and it, the way it looked like, or the way it was um, set up, is that it seemed like Ezra sort of gave his life to beat this enemy. And but then something happened later in the uh, the same episode that led you to believe that he might still be out there. Which like people are questioning how. I mean, again, considering the way it happened, people are wondering how. How did that happen? How are you still alive? Um. So yeah, they're they're gonna have to if if this is true, they're gonna have to find a really really good explanation as to how how he's still alive. Oh boy. So anyway, uh, let me. I think that's gonna be it. Yeah, there's not really that much to uh, to talk about when it comes to this. Um, when it comes to this report, and again, uh, treat this as a rumor. This is treat this as a rumor. Nothing has been confirmed uh, when it comes to these this uh, this this se this, um, this sequel uh, show uh, sequel to Rebels. God, I can't talk today. Um, but anyway, uh, that's gonna be it. Uh, thank you so much for watching and I hope you join me on the next one. Bye.